We're in Los Angeles today with Phil Gordon, two-time champion of the World Poker Tour and co-host of Celebrity Poker Showdown to talk about his book, Phil Gordon's Little Green Book. Hi, Phil. Thanks for joining us today. My pleasure. Thank you. <laughs> poker players are notorious for being secretive and evasive. Yeah. Um, in your book, you pretty much reveal all of your secrets. Why do you, why do, you do that? I want people to play better. Uh, at the end of the day, there are hundreds of millions of people around the world playing Texas Hold'em, and most of them are playing quite poorly. Uh, there's not a lot of great educational literature out there about the game. I think anyone that reads the book would become a better player. Math. You admit at the end of the book that you were surprised there was a lot of math involved in playing poker. Yeah. Do you think that uh, poker has helped you become better at math, or was being good at math something that helped you with poker? The mathematics required to play great poker are no more complicated than third or fourth grade math. If you can multiply by four, multiply by two, and do some simple division and, and multiplication, you can do all the math that's required to play professional winning poker. Uh, that being said, poker is, playing winning poker is a mathematical game. It's 70% psychology, 20% mathematics, and 10% brass balls. In your book, you talk about players who go on tilt. You compare them to pinball machines. Uh, do you ever go on tilt? Uh, when you put your glasses on today, I went on a little bit of a tilt. Yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah. You know, tilt is a, is a state of mind. It's when you're just a little bit rattled and a little bit off your game. Um, it happens to poker players quite often when they lose a big hand that they think that they should win. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't allow that to happen to me at the table. My goal in every single hand is to get my money in with the best hand. If I'm able to do that and my opponent gets lucky, just a part of the game. There's going to be another tournament the next day, another tournament the next day, another tournament the next day. Uh, all you can do is get your money in with the best hand and, and if your opponent gets lucky, shake it off. Great. Thank you so much. Thanks so much for being here with us today. My pleasure. Thank you for wearing your glasses. <laughs> You're welcome. Phil Gordon's Little Green Book is more than an instructional guide to No Limits Texas Hold'em. It gives insight to the way a master plays the game. This book is a must-have for all poker players, whether they want to improve their chances at the table or learn how the pros play. Get your copy and go all in. I'm Janie Haddad, and goodbye. When I first uh, told my parents I was going to be a professional poker player, they said I lost my mind. It was about 1997. Um, you know, poker had not yet reached anywhere near the zenith that it's at right now. Uh, I'd never been on TV. Um, I'd never really won anything in poker. Uh, I'm going to be a professional poker player, and uh, they thought I was absolutely nuts. <laughs> but now they support you. Oh, well, you know, um, the advent of Celebrity Poker Showdown and 42 episodes on, on Bravo on a hit television show can change a lot of, uh, can change a lot of parents' perceptions.